Hey guys, AJ here. This is going to be a different type of video today. So, a couple of days ago, my first conference paper was officially published. Yay! So I'm going to document exactly what happened over the course of a year in a span of a few minutes. Are you ready? I'll start with the brief abstract of the project. So this falls under the topic of computer vision, specifically visual object recognition. The objective is to analyze patterns in bold fMRI scans, which are basically brain images, and determine the object you are currently perceiving. So say that you're looking at a pencil, then my program will scan your brain and say, hey, you're looking at a pencil. I started working on this project in August 2016. At this point, I was starting out in my final year at undergrad, and so I approached my professor with the idea. With his okay, I proceeded determining the objective, getting data, installing required tools, setting up environments, and of course, getting our hands dirty with the actual implementation. By mid-September, I started getting results, and these were just initial results that showed my implementation finally worked. I somehow barely managed to get out of the woods, but there was much that needed improvement. I then began optimizing my code with like all these exhaustive test cases until about mid-October. A full month was required simply because the data was that big. Even verifying one result took hours at a time. I then started writing the long form of the manuscript, emphasizing details for every step. After all, I didn't know what kind of paper this was going to be. It could have been a conference paper, a journal paper, a transactions publication, or even a magazine. I had no idea. At this point, my professor recommended that I publish it in a conference, and so we decided on a suitable one for my work. I then drafted the conference version of this paper, limiting my work to about four to six pages. This is usually the typical limit for a conference paper. And once that was completed, I submitted the manuscript for review by the last week of November. The review committee consisted of four major panels. Each of them provided critical feedback of what a paper lacks and determines whether a paper is either kept or it's trashed. It took them about two and a half months for them to get back to us. A long time. I heard back from them this February. My paper was accepted with major modifications, and we were assigned a shepherd who was a part of the conference committee. With his advice, I needed to address all the modifications and have the camera-ready manuscript by early March. I flew to Mumbai, India on April 5th and presented the paper at the conference on April 8th. What was I doing there for those two days, you ask? Mumbai is a pretty big city. You don't just go there for a conference. IEEE took their own sweet time to determine the quality of papers, and after a good six months, on October 16th, it was finally uploaded to the IEEE Explore Digital Library. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. And yeah, that's how things finally ended up. I hope you guys found this video useful. I tried to make it as generic as possible in the timeline so that it would be useful to some of you guys who may be thinking about publishing at a conference or a journal or anywhere you wish. I'll go into details about my actual paper in a future video. But for now, thank you guys for watching and I hope you liked it. Oh, and subscribe on your way out for more amazing videos. Bye.